How much would you pay for the outfit Chris Brown was wearing that night that he did punch Rihanna? He didn't do <gasps> Everybody here. Yeah, he did. Um. Seabass here from The Woody Show outside of Chris Brown's actual house where he is having today a yard sale. He's selling a bunch of his old items. Fans are lined up down the block for a chance to grab a little bit of what Chris Brown actually did in his real life. We're going to talk to some of these fans and see how much they're willing to pay to get their hands on Chris Brown. Uh, how much are you willing to pay for something for, of Chris Brown's? <laughs> is that a serious question? Um, I've paid like 600 to meet him, so... So before you, may, you meet Chris Brown, they don't make you put on like any kind of like boxing headgear, body armor, or anything? <laughs> no, no, nothing. Oh, okay. Nothing too serious. Now, how much would you pay for the outfit that Chris Brown wore when he beat up that guy in, outside the hotel in D.C.? Oh, wow. wow. Really? <laughs> More than 600? Uh, yeah. Wow. For that actual outfit. Why not? How much would you pay for the outfit Chris was wearing the night that, you know, he beat Rihanna up? <sighs> That's a good question. That's an excellent question. <sighs> I don't know because kind of kind of balance. Sure. So, I want to say about 200-ish. Okay, yeah, cuz you don't want to be disrespectful to yeah. Rihanna. Yeah, not just that, you know, if I resell on eBay, you know how many you know, one beaters out there and just like want to buy it. So you never know. You, you never know. I hadn't thought of that. A, a, a professional woman beater might want to buy. Right, right. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. How much would you pay for the outfit Chris was wearing when he sucker punched that photographer in Tampa? In Tampa? I'm actually from Florida, so like I probably wouldn't buy it. You okay, know? because it would be disrespectful to your home state. Exactly, yeah. yeah. How much would you spend on the outfit that Chris wore when he called Frank Ocean the gay F word outside that recording studio? I don't know. Nah. You want that one? Nah, I ain't going for it. It's got too much bad, nah. bad juju on it. Yeah, 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 yeah. How much would you pay for Chris's copy of the re restraining order that Rihanna filed against him? Oh, Ooh, I, have a, I have a lot of friends who like Rihanna. That wouldn't be right. I can't. I'm, so, I'm not paying for that either. Wow. I'm sorry. Well, you have some ethics and some morals then. Yeah, yeah. No Florida stuff, no Rihanna stuff. He's selling that? Are you serious? Now, Crystal, how are you able to get off work to come out to Chris Brown's house today? Um, I don't have to go to work. Oh, there you go. That must be very nice. Independently wealthy. I like that. Yes, yeah, sort of. <laughs> okay, very nice. <laughs> so now, what of Chris Brown's are you looking to purchase today? A lot of s***. <laughs> now, who's this? How do you know this person? Um, he's my cousin. I'm his camera cousin. We finna go shopping. This is your cousin. Now, your cousin's flashing a lot of $100 bills. Yeah, I know, and I don't know why, because now they're going to go in my pocket. How much would you pay for the outfit Chris Brown was wearing when, he's, when he was detained for rape in Paris recently? Oh, wow. Um... Um, uh, 500, same thing. Okay. Yep. Yeah, nice, yeah, a little bit of a historical factor there. He didn't do it. <laughs> that's right, he was acquitted. That's right, they released him eventually. Mm -hmm. So that was one of the things Chris Brown actually didn't do. That's right. Now, they are thinking about selling the monkey that Chris Brown was keeping illegally in his house. How much would you pay for that capuchin monkey? Is it legal to sell in California? Look, a lot of things Chris Brown doesn't do, do don't really do have to do with legal or not legal. Yeah, I don't think sure. he cares. Yeah, I'll buy it. Probably like 5 G's max. It's a monkey, right? How much yeah. does a monkey go for? Uh, good question. Yeah, so I would have to look that up. Now, Muhammad, you said you're from Jersey. Jersey, Patterson, New Jersey, baby. And did you fly in just for Chris Brown's yard sale? No, we already flew in and we saw the radio, so we just came on down. Yeah, I, saw, I see the radio a lot, and uh, that's why we came out here as well. I grow weed. Oh. <laughs> I'm in the weed business. How much would you pay for the outfit Chris wore when he got kicked out of rehab for bashing in his mother's window in her car? Ooh. All right. How about the outfit he wore at the Indigo Tour, or oh. the outfit he wore at the Fame Tour, or the outfit I, he wore... I didn't see those on the list. The street, you know? How much would you pay for the Halloween costume Chris wore a few years ago, where he dressed as an Islamic terrorist? Oh, sh**. <laughs> oh, like, no more than a thousand? No more than a thousand? Yeah. Yeah, because him and all his friends were, like, yeah. had beards and stuff. Yeah, cool. How much would you pay for Chris's copy of the restraining order that Karuchi Tran filed against him? I can't. I, I, I can't. Like, uh, okay, okay. Probably like a hundred. Okay. <laughs> you can support Chris Brown, but not all the time. Not all the time, yeah. How much would you pay for the outfit Chris Brown was wearing that night that he did punch Rihanna? He didn't do <gasps> it. Anybody here? Yeah, he did. Um, a 500, same 500. Thing. Your cousin said he didn't do it. I think he did. Okay, but only 500 for that? Yeah. Just because of the memories? Yeah, and, that's not a good memory. How much would you pay for the outfit Chris Brown was wearing when he stole that woman's phone in Las Vegas? Oh, man. What was he wearing? The Louis V shoes and all that? I believe so, yes. Uh, no more than like 700, 800. Okay. It's, not, it's him stealing the phone, so whatever. Yeah, it's not a big, not a big crime or anything. He, he's had much worse. Yeah, true. How much would you pay for Chris Brown's outfit that he wore 
when he threw that chair into the window at Good Morning America? Oh, um, maybe 200 But how much would you pay for the outfit Chris was wearing? For Rihanna, I heard that. Yeah, yeah money. That's, it's going to be gone. I mean, like how much? If, if, it was, I, if I had a chance to buy it, no more than 5Gs. Okay. Yeah. That's the limit. That's the limit. How much would you pay for the outfit Chris was wearing <laughs> when he beat up that guy in Vegas at that basketball game? Now, if you were to ask me how much I would have paid for the outfit he, he was wearing when he beat Rihanna's ass. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, excuse my language. I'm sorry. That's okay. But, um... No, nah, because I'm not a supporter of anybody putting their hands on a woman. Okay. You know what I mean? You know, he did the wrong thing, but, you know, God forgives. Mm -hmm. That's all I got to say, you guys. Oh, thank you Peace so much. Peace out. Yeah. No, <laughs>can you want to shout out your weed brand? Oh yeah, Mo Packs on Instagram. All right, check it out. Any, for any, any type of weed you specialize in? Oh, Afghanish Kush.